Hi everyone, welcome to Book Ravings. I decided to film this video because I'm almost finishing my TBR. This month has been amazing despite the fact that I'm, I went back working, so my schedule is really tight nowadays. I finished really many books. I will film a wrap up. This will be a currently reading video. I will show you guys two books I'm currently reading and I'd like to comment some things about them. Uh, the first one is The Red and the Black. This is the classic book I planned to read in March. I'm having a great time with it. The Red and the Black is a book written by Stendhal. Let me put the book to you to see. It was published in France post-Napoleonic era and it is considered one of the biggest worldwide classics. It tells the story of Julian Sorel, an ambitious son of a carpenter and he does what he can to ascend socially and this is a romance by Stendhal and the way he tells the story it was really revolutionary because it puts the reader inside the mind of the protagonist so it is a style that will influence writers such as Flaubert and Dostoevsky uh, some years later and I'm really um, surprised with the style uh, used by Stendhal and the quality of the pacing of this book. I wasn't expecting that. I was expecting like a social criticism work and what I found here was a beautiful romance with a really interesting and unusual character. Julian Sarah was really unusual. It is interesting to get to know him. He's a real character. It is confusing to understand him because he is really complex. He looks like a real person inside out, you know? And in this book, you are able to go into his mind and to know what he is thinking. And this makes the book really interesting. So I do recommend this book. I didn't finish yet. I have more like 100, 150 pages. I'm reading it slowly. I'm like tasting it and enjoying bits uh, bit by bit. In 2017, when I'm trying to read more classic books, I'm actually trying to limit the recent releases I'm reading, so I'm trying to choose really well. Uh, and that's because I want to know better the best works in literature, and I chose 12 books, one book per month, one classic per month, and this was my book for March. In January, I tried to read Don Quixote, I, I didn't finish, I stopped in the middle, I was enjoying, it was pen painful, so I just quit it. Last month, in February, I read Moby Dick, did enjoy, it has its merits, but overall I did enjoy it. And this was a big surprise because I'm reading it like it was published yesterday. This, this cover is quite nice, here we have a, an interesting illustration, but this book looks so serious and so like traditional and this story is quite amazing and the romance is like a torrid and dramatic romance. And I'm also reading Fires of Heaven, book 5 of the Wheel of Time series by Robert Jordan. Let the dragon ride again on the winds of time. I hate these editions. And this one I have here just to show you guys how thick, how big it is. But I'm actually listening to the audiobook while I'm traveling. The audiobook is about 34 hours. So I listened to 40% of the audio. Robert Jordan is an amazing writer. I can't imagine the process of writing these books. So I filmed a video about the design of these editions here. I don't like the design, but I'll put the link here if you haven't watched it yet. But this story itself is amazing, so far so good. And the audiobook is narrated by two different people, a male and a female narrator, and this makes the experience of listening to it more interesting. So this was just a quick video about the books I'm currently reading and March has been amazing. I'm enjoying a lot the books I chose to read this month and I'm also enjoying a lot filming these videos and the booktube community is amazing. I'm enjoying it a lot. Thank you very much for watching. Let me know your opinions about these books. Have you read them yet? Yes? No? 
Let me know in the comments. See ya and thanks for watching.